Hello, fair maidens, and welcome now to Tuesday. Well, sunny and truly cool today for the Virgos. The moon continues in your sign, which is why everything runs a little bit more efficiently when the moon's in Virgo. You'll notice that people think like you do for only a couple days of the month. I think, though, for you, it means emotional tranquility between your heart and your ego. They're working side by side. In fact, today in particular, you are incredibly charismatic. You should have a lot of uh, ability to speak on your feet. You might even get called to service. Sometimes the moon is in our sign. That's when the universe pushes out there to do what we do best. But for everyone on the whole planet today, the Soul Collective combined, I'm predicting today's a day of shining bright and doing some healing. Now, if you're doing any healing today at all, it's probably around your own ego. And, you know, sometimes Virgos need to be called into duty to feel good about themselves. A lot of times Virgos don't realize how amazing they are until they go off and heal like 20 different patients. And they're like, you know, maybe I am nice. <laughs> Now, the shining bright with Sun and Gemini is really all around career. Today, the Sun moves into Chapter 3, the final 10 days of the Sun-Gemini transit. It's now time to start moving forward with your career plans, is what that boils down to. You'll still be doing a lot of rethinking with the Mercury retrograde, so don't have to have all the answers. You just need to know what to do next, and I think today you're feeling strong about what you know so far. Then lastly, speaking of doing next, Mars in Leo, in your subconscious, in the next 24 hours, Mars is going to ask Virgos to make a small decision about the way they have faith in themselves and what action to take next to get even more faith. You having faith in yourself is your biggest point of power. Virgos are basically perfect souls. The only thing that makes them not perfect is that they think they're not, right? And so to have inner faith that's strong means you get into power. So in the next 24 hours, it's time to make a decision inside your heart, probably about an action to take that will make you feel better about yourself and get uh, an inner faith that is not stoppable, non-stoppable. And then on Wednesday and Thursday, those are the days to actually take the action. All right, fair maidens, that's all I have for Tuesday. I'll see you tomorrow with more. Live, love, be.